Hello everyone. In this video I show you the plants I have on my balcony. I hope you enjoy the tour. Please subscribe and leave your comments below. Let me know any questions or comments. The first one is ginger. I am sprouting these and they have been successful so far. I am waiting for the green shoots to be bigger and then I put them in the soil. This is very easy to do. All you need is to put the ginger in a container with some water and you keep it moist. I'm looking forward to plant them. The second plant is something I haven't planted. Um, this is pepper and it showed up on its own. The pot has stalks and I'm eager to see them flowering. Uh, these are new, I'm not sure if they would flower this year but uh, they have purple uh, flower and it's very fragrant so the pepper has been doing very well and as you can see there are small uh, pepper kernels starting to show these are my daffodils I leave the stems because they provide nutrition to the pulps uh, while uh, sleeping um, during the summertime and early winter. You can cut the brown leaves. First one is the crassula. I had a broken plant and decided to turn it into a planter. And I like to see uh, the color of the crassula with the light color of the plant. It has been showing uh, signs of growth on top of it. but it grows very slowly and I love how it looks um, the leaves themselves look like little flowers 
and the pink color signifies the new growth if you can see it here um, I like also the color of the leaves and um, um, I find that it likes um, the shade more than the direct sunlight of course uh, it gets some sunlight but uh, I put it mostly in the shade I don't water them much uh, maybe once a week or even less in the winter and in the summer uh, it depends on the weather actually look how nice the top of the crassula looks like and in this container I've put some cardamom seeds I'm not sure they will sprout This is my beautiful colorful croton. It is recovering now and new leaves are growing. I cannot wait to see them uh, bigger and more colorful. The leaves usually have different colors and the plant uh, does not like uh, full sun or even um, cold weather it prefers moderate temperatures um, and it also does not like uh, too much water maybe once a week in the summer even um, but it looks very beautiful in its full growth this is Arabian Jasmine the flower is very fragrant especially in the afternoon But I hear from my friends that uh, they really struggle to keep it. It's difficult to grow. The flower is uh, white and as I said, it is fragrant. Now this is my newest spring container. I have cleaned it recently and put uh, three um, plants. This is geranium. The flower uh, has a nice scent. And um, this is coleus. I love the color. And the third one, you can see there is the uh, thyme. Uh, Three, the three plants don't like too much water so it's a good idea to have them in one container I'm even thinking of getting another coleus of course a different color and this is my aloe vera it's very easy to grow it does not require care And I like how it looks. Of course, it's an evergreen plant. If you're thinking of having something that is green all year round. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you visit my store. I'll link it below. And also watch my tulips. Have a good day. Bye.